Hey guys, in this video, I'm going to walk you through the steps on how to add family members or users to your YouTube TV account. And I'm also going to test to see if this will work if you're sharing it with family members that don't live at your same home address. So what we want to do is head on over to tv.youtube.com. I'll link this page down in the description. Make sure you sign into your account. Once you're signed in, what we want to do is go to the little circle in the upper right hand corner to click on your account info. And with this drop down menu, what we want to do is click on where it says settings. In our settings over here on the side, we want to select where it says family sharing. And then in family sharing, we want to click on manage. This takes us over to our family group members and you can send up to five invitations to add those to your YouTube TV family account. So clicking this little plus sign next to send invitations. And you can either select emails from this drop down list if they show up or you can type a name or email in right here to send it that way as well. So once we have the family members email typed in, we can click send. And the invitation has been sent. You'll get a confirmation email when your invitation is accepted. If you want to send another invitation, you can click that option here. Otherwise, we can click got it to move on to the next page. And you're going to be the primary family manager and your info is going to be right here at the top. The invitations that you send are going to show up below here. So this family member that I sent the invite to accepted. Now I sent the invite to a non Google email. I sent it to their MSN email, but when they were accepting and signing up, they had to log in to a Gmail or a Google account. So that's something to keep in mind. I also wanted to do some additional testing to see how sharing works. Under the YouTube TV family group information, we can see that for family member requirements, they need to live in the same household as the family manager. And if we continue to scroll down, it says the family group members need to periodically use the YouTube TV in your home location to keep access. I wanted to test this out. So what I did is I sent an invite to a family member of mine who lives about 25 miles from me. So they don't live in the same household. They live in a different city but they do live in an area that has the same local channels as me. So I'm not sure how much that matters. And I wanted to test if they could use my YouTube TV subscription at their house. So with testing this out, I had them log in and watching YouTube TV on a web browser at their location, as well as logging into their smart TV. They used a Roku TV to log in to the YouTube TV subscription, and it was able to work for them. And I was able to watch YouTube TV on my smart TV at the same time that they were also utilizing the subscription on their smart TV. This was at two different addresses, two different internet connections, so we were able to share. Your mileage may vary on this because it's not the intended use of the family group for YouTube TV, but I'm just giving you my example and what happened in my situation where we were able to share at different locations using different internet connections and watching streams at the same time. For whatever reason, if you ever want to remove a member from your family group, you can always click on their member status and click on the remove member option. And that'll wrap this one up. So I hope this video was helpful going over how you can add family members to family sharing in your YouTube TV account. I appreciate you guys stopping by. Consider subscribing to the YouTube channel and I'll see you back here next time.